hello everyone and welcome back to our youtube channel today in this video we will see the assembly language program of converting an 8 bit number into two nibbles this process is also known as masking off that means you can be asked to mask off the least significant bit or the most significant bit of a 8 bit number and if you mask both the lsb and msb of a number then it will be converted into two nibbles so i think you know what is a nibble but if you don't know let me make you understand so we know we have a 8 bit number right and this is known as a byte but a nibble consists of 4 bits okay so we can say that one byte number has two nibbles so if you take any 8 bit number like 4 f hex so here you can see this is the most significant bit and this is the least significant bit so this is known as upper nibble and this is known as lower nibble so what does masking means let's consider this example 4 f hex so how can we perform masking on this number if we perform the least significant bit mask off it means that the least significant bit will be converted into zero so lsv mask off will result into 40 hex and if we perform masking off on most significant bit then the result will be 0 f hex so i hope you can understand that lsb masking will convert the least significant bit into 0 and msb masking will convert the most significant bit to 0 and here you can see that a 8 bit number is converted into two nibbles and that is what we need to do in this assembly language program so how we will do that let's write 4 f in binary format so this is equals to 0 1 0 0 1 1 1 1 right this is 4 f hex now if we want to mask off the least significant bit then see what we need to do we need to convert all these four bits into zeros and if you think about the boolean algebra then by performing the and operation if we perform the and operation with zeros here then what will happen all these four bits will be converted into zeros and here we will take one only so that this part of the answer does not get changed so this is f0 hex and if you perform the and operation between these two numbers then one and zero is equals to zero one and zero is zero 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 and zero and one is zero again zero one and one is one and zero and one is zero so here you can see this least significant four bits are converted into zero but the most significant bit remain unchanged and that's what we need so this is the masking of least significant bit of an 8 bit number now if you want to perform the masking of on the most significant bit then what we need to do again take the same example 0 1 0 0 1 1 1 1 so if we perform the and operation with 0 f hex okay this is 0 and then 1 right and we will perform and between these two numbers then 1 and 1 is 1 1 and 1 is 1 1 and 1 here 0 0 0 and 0 so here you can see the most significant four bits are converted into zeros and the least significant four bits are remaining unchanged so this is msb masking and this is lsb masking all right so i hope you got the concept now let's write its assembly language program in 8085 so in the beginning we need to input this data on which we want to perform the masking operation so let's directly load it into the accumulator from c050 hex address that is lda c050 hex address now what we are performing here we are performing the and operation with f0 hex right so we will perform the ani f0 hex this is and immediate that means the content of accumulator will be logically ended with f0 hex so 4 f hex will be ended with f0 hex all right and here we will get 4 0 hex right now let's store it in the next memory location c051 hex 
so this is the masking of least significant bit now for most significant bit we will again load this data so again we can write it like uh, lda c050 hex to input the same data and now the and operation will be performed with what 0fx right so this will be 4f and 0f is equals to 0fx right and this is also in the accumulator so let's store it in the next location c052x this is c051 and then hold all right so here we have masked off the least significant bit and here we are masking the most significant bit and in this way we have converted the 8 bit number into two labels so i hope this video is clear to you in the next video we will see how to check whether the digits of a number are equal or not so if you like this video please subscribe my channel so that you can get all the notifications of my upcoming videos and and you can watch out all other videos of 8085 microprocessor of this playlist so see you in the next video thank you